Georgia Tech's basketball programs are in disarray just days after the men's team was hit with multiple NCAA violations. Today, Georgia Tech fired its women's basketball coach, Michelle Joseph, following an internal investigation. We obtained a copy through an open records request. In it, claims that Joseph was mentally and verbally abusive toward her team. It pained me to read what they had to say about the program. Athletic director Todd Stansbury on a conference call saying he was hurt after reading the investigation that included reports from 40 different people. Every current student athlete alleged emotional and mental mistreatment by Joseph. Words like toxic, suffocating, and hostile were used to describe the environment she created and described her conduct as bullying. Joseph allegedly would get in players' faces and call them offensive names. Players felt too intimidated to bring up the issues. They believe the team's psychologist, Dr. Bellin Gutter, revealed confidential information to Joseph. Joseph's supporters say she is an intense coach doing what coaches do. We need focus and concentration. Nobody plays afraid. Joseph's lawyer, Lisa Banks, alleges Tech created an unlawful campaign against her. They claim Tech manufactured the allegations because of her efforts for gender equality at Georgia Tech. But the investigation added that players' comments could lead to potential NCAA violations. The men's program is facing serious violations of its own. They include an assistant coach taking a recruit to a strip club and giving him $300 to spend. Men's coach Josh Pastner was not named in the violations. Regardless, the state of basketball at Georgia Tech is at its lowest. All right, thanks a lot, Jeff.